MDCT National Chairperson Morgan Kamichi has launched a blistering attack on President Emerson Nangagwa's faltering administration saying it has no capacity to solve the country's multifaceted problems. This follows protests by civil servants for an upward review of their salaries which has fallen on deaf ears. Zimbabwe's economy has continued to experience turbulence, and in February the country's inflation spiked to 66.1% and has been gradually rising in the past months. This is further highlighted by the introduction of the ZW $100 note by the RBZ after all smaller denominations had been hard hit by inflation coupled by cash shortages, unemployment, fuel shortages and mismanagement of resources. Kamichi said with the poor economy, legislators will soon be reduced to beggars on the streets as their allowances can barely pay for their basic needs. An MP's payslip in 2020 had $18.654 which translates to a bit US $50 in the black market. If you see an MP's payslip, you will cry. It will not be surprising to see MPs begging in the streets. Their salaries and allowances are just as good as that of a teacher. There is nothing. Look at all civil servants, look at the soldiers, the police and all, it shows there is no capacity by this government to sustain its citizens. There is no hope anymore, Kamichi said. The black market rate is now ZW $360, and how can civil servants survive? How can people survive? They have failed to run this country, people are angry and starving. Dottie further pinned his hopes on a new as the best solution to the myriad of challenges the country is faced with. He added, if you think of winner take all, you are backward, you are useless, and you don't know how to resolve the economic crisis of this country. The government system must be inclusive in nature.